Obviously, my name is Bob Shoup. I'm the new defense coordinator coaching the safeties. Uh, I've been here since about early December, December 8th, right before that first recruiting weekend. I, I've really enjoyed uh, uh, getting to know the staff, getting to know the players. You know, uh, you know, one of the things coming from my background, I was at uh, one double A guy for a long, long time. Uh, James Franklin got the head coaching job at Vanderbilt and gave a uh, one double A coach a chance to be a defense coordinator in the SEC. In our three years there, you know, we went to three straight bowls. You know, had two nine win seasons, two top twenty five finishes. Always had top twenty defenses. Put a bunch of guys in the NFL and. And James had a chance to go to Penn State, and uh, it was a wonderful experience. Went back and coached at Penn State for two years with coach, went to two straight bowls. Again, same sort of thing, had top 10, top 15 defenses, put in new, numerous players in the NFL. And uh, I really, after having got a taste of SEC football, really aspired to get back to the SEC, and, and Coach Jones gave me a chance at Tennessee. And in our first year at Tennessee, you know, we went 9-4, and four, beat Florida, beat Georgia, beat Nebraska, beat Virginia Tech. Um, you know, expectations are high at, at all these SEC schools, you know, so they expect a little bit more. We won the Music City Bowl that year, had a number one draft pick in Derek Barnett. And looking back on it with all the injuries and things we had, you know, I thought it was a pretty good coaching job. Uh, this past year, you know, at Tennessee we got off to a 3-1 and one start. Uh, you know, lost a tough one to, to well, excuse me, got crushed by Georgia. Uh, lost 15-9 to to South Carolina, dropped the pass in the end zone on the last play of the game to be 3-3. Three and three. Then lost to Alabama, we were 3-4. And four. and then, uh, you know, there, there's pressure in, at all these SEC jobs. Everybody's calling for a Coach Jones job and things like that. And, and uh, these last six or seven weeks were probably the toughest I've ever had to deal with professionally, the last six or seven weeks of that season. Uh, my wife and I, when we talked about our future, we said there's only a couple boxes that we want to check. We want to go to a place with great culture. And I found that to be the case here at Mississippi State, um, from Mr. Cohen to Jared Benko to Joe Moorhead and the staff to the players. I mean, you can see that Coach Mullen and his uh, experience here has coached these guys to eight straight bowls. I watch these guys play on film. They play hard. I watch uh, them prepare for the bowl game with a skeleton crew. They practiced hard. I've watched them in the weight room. I've watched you know, our morning workouts. You know, there's a, good, there's a great culture here. And I want to be around good people. And I feel that way about not just the team, not just the coaching staff, but everybody I've met that's been affiliated with Mississippi State Athletics and everybody in Starkville. So I'm appreciative of this opportunity and I look forward to, to working with you guys and look forward to being a part of this, this team, this town, and this family.